Well, a woman sues the Reese's company for false advertisement and will also have a healthy for life segment. Good morning, West Virginia starts right now. This is Good Morning Virginia. Good evening. Thank you for joining. I mean, good morning. Thank you for joining us. I've been up way too long already. Um, I'm Larry Misho. It is six o'clock and it is thirty-eight degrees outside of Charleston. This is Good Morning West Virginia. Well, a woman sues the Reese's company because of alleged misleading images on packages. We also have learned that the, some of the CW affiliates are going to be moving um, locations on your dial. Now let's take a look at the map positions right now. Uh, I'm trying to angle my camera, but you do apologize for the technical difficulty. Um, we'll be right back in just a moment. This is Good Morning West Virginia. All right, we are now back, and I got to sit back down at the desk. Um, I'm trying to get that in the background because I want that in my video, that logo. Damn it. There we go. We also learned that um, in this week for life, I'll be taking a look at heart attacks. If you are someone that walks on autism spectrum and you get harassed by people yelling out the car window, we did ask the experts and they say that that could cause a heart attack if the person is startled. So um, the recommendations are wear earbuds to not be able to hear the person. For this week's Healthy for Life, I'm Larry Show. Good morning, West Virginia. And of course, your current weather, it is 38 degrees Fahrenheit in, in the area. Um, for the 3rd of January, 2024, we are, it is supposed to be a little bit cloudy, maybe sunny with a high, with it being a little bit warmer and maybe 50 degrees. Um, no precip, but they, we are calling for it this weekend with lows in the, um, the 30s for the rest of the work week and thank you for joining us on good morning west virginia um i'm larry mishu we'll be back at noon for the entire team wish you a great morning and i hope you tomorrow is just as nice as you want it to be